So, recently I ordered a gas mask on Shopee. Shopee from China. And it cost me quite a lot of money. Around 410 ringgit. So I urge you, please watch this video or I will file for bankruptcy. So, right now with me, this box is the FMJ08, uh, infamously known as the Avon S10 copy. So, here are the contents in this box. Uh, now, as you can see, I have not opened the parcel yet. I, I'm, I haven't done any changes to it or anything yet. Uh, straight up like this, I'm going to open it with you. you? Okay, you got a layer of bubble wrap, another layer, another layer, another one, another one, another one, another one. Now you have your box. Oh, put that aside for now. Hold on. You got another bubble wrap. Very nice, fine, deep bubble wrap. That's good. Now you have your very good box. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, so this is the box, the FMJ08. Okay. You can see on the other side, the FMJ08. I'm gonna put this aside for one. Alright. The sides are here. Okay. So this is the box. Uh this is the contents, right? So now you may notice that there's a little crack. The box right here it's damaged at the corner just a little crack seller informed me that uh this happened during shipping uh well i don't blame them this is made of very thin plastic kind of kind of very cheap plastic but anyways uh so let us open this uh mask how the heck do you open this Oh, okay, 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 I got it. Alright. There you go. Alright. Okay. Yo, this is heavy. Okay, so this is the mask right here. Okay, hold on, yeah. Uh, this is the, this is the carry bag. Alright. This is the instruction manual i don't read chinese so i'm gonna translate the whole thing later uh yeah instruction manual over here right over here then this is the box uh in here hello there yeah this is the box this is the lid all right okay so i'm gonna put this box aside it's taking up a lot of space yeah. Okay, so uh, first let's look at the back. Okay, so this is kind of poorly made, in my opinion. Uh, it's, it's kind of the tailoring of it, it's kind of poorly made. You can see my screen. But I don't blame them because this is not the main content of the the product yeah it's very poorly made but whatever it's trying to do I'm put this all right instruction manual we're here i don't read chinese so oh well. all right so this is the mask and here okay. Okay, this is the mask right here i'm gonna wash it later uh, this is the filter. It's bigger than I thought. Okay, um hold on me. I think something is missing here because uh you know that when I ordered this there was this plastic thing that was attached to the filter. Uh, like this right thing. I'll show it on the screen later. But it's not here. So I guess that was uh 
packaging error, I think, but doesn't really matter. Yeah, the mask, uh, the mask is fine. The mask is fine. I think I haven't really looked into it yet. You can see the the uh, the box. This bit fell off. So the filter is this. So this is the mask. Now you can see that it uh, looks like the S10 gas mask. It nearly looks like it, right? I'm not going to put it on yet because, uh, well, it's very dirty. You can look at this. So yeah, I have to clean it. So yeah, uh, I'm going to show you the interior of the mask. All right. So you can see the straps of it. These are the straps of it. Alright. So this is the interior of the mask. The interior. Alright. So yeah. Got your nasal cup right here. You got your drinking tube. Uh, your voice diaphragm. And yeah. It's dusty, dirty has to go through some cleaning I'll clean it later this thing is like 3d bro I mean like kind of pops up you get a good view here like this uh, lens this lens it's popping up I don't know if you can actually see it it's kind of hard for you to see it but yeah uh, this is the mask outside like this this is the axle valve your drinking tube system is here rubber this is the way you put your filter in uh this is the radio thing okay so uh before i bought this mouse i was quite curious if there were any electronics in here like wires or whatever so right now we're gonna check if there's any in there i hope there's not because it'll be harder for me to wash it so a rubber, you know? I think there's none. No, no there's not. Hold on, yeah. I know you can't see a thing, but there's completely none. Yeah, you can't see a thing. That's a shame. But yeah, there, there, there's no there's no electronic or whatever. So yeah. Uh yeah, this is the straps and all that. So yeah, this is the mask. This is the mask. Hey, it stands back, so okay. So this is the filter. Now we're gonna look at the filter. Let me get a pair of scissors. The filter is triggered with that the plastic things are there. Because uh, not only that is uh, important, that's also important to structure the mask like to display it or something so yeah i'm kind of disappointed that's not it's not here uh okay this is the filter i think that okay it looks like it has been opened uh, if you look if you look here you can see that like this and you can look it back uh don't forget to pull this out when you're using the gas mask or you suffocate yourself majority of the death came from this uh, from using gas mask you suffocate yourself Okay, so this is made of uh, iron, like steel, I think, like steel. Yeah, can you hear it? Okay, so yeah, uh, this is plastic, this is uh, rubber, uh, this is dirty. Okay, so uh, I'm going to open this. Uh, there's some things here, I don't know why is it saying. Okay, so um, I'm going to open this. Yeah, as you can see in here All right i think this is the oh no it looks yellow my god it's trying to build this uh okay then i'm gonna pull this up here and you can see this this is the bottom part of it All right so yeah uh i'm not gonna use it now so i'm gonna seal it okay never mind then uh so yeah let's look at this gas mask more because this is the main attraction here you can see you can bend the nose so this is the drinking tube system all right 
don't mind the cat if you hear it. Okay, so uh, you can see the gas mask here, right? Okay, so there's a lever here. You pull this down. It basically like unlocks the drinking tube. Okay, you drink water with it. Uh, I think it's this. Hold up, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. I got it. Okay. So when you pull the lever, uh, this actually happens. Okay. Stay with me, yeah. Okay. You see the interior of the gas mask, right? Okay. When I pull the lever, this happens. See? You see it, right? See? It basically moves the tube. So if you're not using it, it'll be like this, in this position. If you're using it, then it will be like this. Basically straight up into your mouth. And when you're not using it, you put it back. There we go. It goes back into the resting position. So, yeah, that is the drinking tube. Okay, so this is the voice diaphragm thing with bits over here. There you go. This is the voice diaphragm and the XOR valve. So if you want to clean it, you have to pull this out so that it won't break. You can see it's like blue and all that. So yeah, and when I pull it out, it's basically like this. And the drinking straw. Come on, man. Where is the drinking straw? Why is it wet? Oh, oh okay, okay, I got it, I got it. All right. Okay, so, so look at this. Look at this. There you go. You're drinking straw. And basically, like, when you want to drink, you just, like, put this in the water and just suck. Yeah. That's how you drink. And now, uh, when you're not using it, you put it back. Put it back like this, in a circle, right? Back to the hole. Push it in. Nice, right? Close this lever. Wait, no, I just open it. Yeah, you, yeah, okay, you close it. There you go, done. So, yeah, this is the mask. Uh, I'll show it more to you when I finish washing it. So, right now, I'm gonna wash it. Basically, I'm just gonna soak it in water. There's a marking on the filter 727 or 721. Can't even tell. Yeah, I'm not sure about this filter. It's very. Uh, what's the word? Okay, so the filter weights are uh, around 0 0.280 kg. Uh, I think it was manufactured at 2021 this year on the 12th wait wait no no, no. yeah on the t on the 3rd of december yeah you can see the thing i don't think you can see it. it's very blur but yeah uh the filter is a zbp2 2 filter i'm not sure what does that mean but i know the p2 stands for particulate uh, level 2 not level 3 but level 2 so yeah uh, I don't know about the Z this is weird I've never seen this uh, if you look at the chart on the screen right now there is completely no word saying Z I don't know what the Chinese are up to all right so we're now in the process of washing the gas mask so first thing you want to do is uh, grab Dishwashing soap. Yeah, make sure to put this. Alright, let me just raise this up. Put a little. Oh god, it's too much. Okay. So, put the mask here. It's kind of hard to do it with one hand, so I apologize. Uh, put the mask here. Alright. Then get soap a little on it should be fine because masks like this are made to stand you know soap. Uh, make sure to get in a little in those holes in there. Alright. So yeah. Uh, now you're gonna just let it sit in here. So yeah. 
wash this. Uh, do not wash the filter. Alright, so just a little water in here. Water in here. Alright, wash it up. I hope I don't drop my phone. It'll be embarrassing. Okay. See that dirt there? Yeah, we clean it. That's why it's important to wash your gas mask. You don't want to be sniffing dirt. It's full of dirt every time. Same thing goes to all the gas masks. My first gas mask, the GP5, uh, I washed it several times because I was uh, very scared of the, Abas the Abastos. Yeah, Abastos. You know, the, the Soviets like to put Abastos on their gas mask. Look at the water, it's like grey or something. Look at how dirty that is. Yeah, so I'm gonna pause the video and do more uh, intense washing for it. Okay, so uh, update, the water was too dirty, it was literally like black and I had to rinse it out and now I'm gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna flood this in and we're gonna let it sit for like 10 minutes uh, get a little soap here. Yeah, and then after that, when we're done with this, we're gonna be cleaning this but gently because you don't want to damage this very gentle parts and after that, this, this thing I'll just like Clorox or something. So this is it now. So yeah. Nothing much to show here, but uh... Alright, so I've cleaned everything already. Everything's in here. I left the back to dry for night. It's dried already. So sanitize the box and all ready. So yeah. Uh, this is the mask. When it's clean, oh uh, you can see the shiny black there you go right over here. The filter, the canister right here. And the bag. I found out that the bag is uh hydrophobic, so it's uh not homophobic but hydrophobic so yeah uh, instruction manual is still right here okay so I'm gonna leave this uh, as you can see I got my GP5 over here we'll use it later for the filter here okay so we roll my sleeve so yeah you can see the gas mask it's right here this is a 14 millimeter filter so yeah i'm gonna screw this filter in right now okay so i'm gonna screw it in on this side right on this side there you go uh, now if you play csgo uh, it might look like something that the uh, counter there is way uh that's called the s10 this is the Chinese version. So yeah. Okay. So yeah, it fits perfectly in here. Now we're gonna fit this uh, in here. This gas mask. This is called the GP5. Uh, as you can see right here. This is quite antique because this is made of Cold War. So yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna screw this filter in the GP5. Here, I'm just gonna screw it in. There you go. I don't know if you can see. There you go. Right here, it screws uh, perfectly in. Yeah, this is the cap and all that. Okay, the rain is very loud. Hold on. Okay, uh, you might be hearing some rain, but. Uh, I don't know if the OBS noise suppression is good enough, but yeah, I can't do anything. Okay, so apparently I forgot to press the record button and I have to redo this again. But yeah, anyways, let's get into it. 
So this is the mask right here. Let's talk about the product. Not the mask, but the product. I bought this for like 380 ringgit. Uh, but plus shipping will be 410. Uh, yeah, that's a big amount of money, but I'll get into that later. So yeah, uh, but if you compare to the other sellers, right, some are selling it for 700 ringgit, some 800, can even amount to 900. Some have even have the audacity to sell it for a thousand ringgit, which is insane. The amount of audacity that they have to sell it for that price is just insane. I got it from this this mask. I got it from a very good seller. He sold it to me for only like 380 ringgit. I asked for discount, but uh, he said that he couldn't give any. But well, that's understandable because like it's the cheapest out there. It's already a discount. So yeah, I got it from him. Quite a nice guy. Uh, very transparent seller. So what happened was basically uh, he told me that the box is cracked. This box right here, it's cracked. He told me in advance that there's a problem, and he apologized for it. You know that not many sellers will do that. Not many sellers are that transparent. Normally, what the sellers will do is just that they just send you the product and they get the money. That's all. That's what they normally do. But this guy, transparent, a very transparent, with very honest guy. That's what I can say. Uh, very nice to know him and to buy from him. Definitely, if I want to buy another gas mask, I'll buy it from him again. But yeah. So yeah, uh, this mask, right? It's quite comfortable. Let's look at the inside again. Yeah, I know I show it in the starting of the video, but I think I didn't went into details. So right here, as you can see, you see this bottom part? This is a, a resting area for your chin and all that. It's very comfortable. And you got your filter right here. So now let's talk about why I have a gas mask in the first place. So, you see, I don't like surgical masks. You know those surgical masks, right? The one that the government tells you to use and all that. The one that they say that it will work. Well, the thing with surgical masks, it's not meant to protect you. It's meant to protect the other person. So that's one thing. It's not that I don't like to protect other people. It's the fact that it's not effective enough. Because, okay, you see, surgical mask, right? It's a half face mask. Number one, you're not protecting your eyes. You have to wear a face shield, which you have to spend more money on. Number two, it's uh, one use of wear and tear. So it's not very effective, in, financially speaking. One box of the face mask will, will uh, easily amount up to like let's say 25 ringgit at the cheapest, 50 ringgit uh, the most expensive. You can even amount up to 80 ringgit for one box. Depends on like you know how how much quality you want to put into those masks. But again, it's disposable, like right? it's a one-use thing. And one box will only last you for like one month if you're like working every day you're going out means that every day you're wearing a mask so it won't last you that long okay sometimes you have to wear two masks also because like your mask got wet or whatever you gotta account to that also so yeah but if now let's talk about the gas mask okay the gas mask this thing will last you five years the filter to last you like five years this thing will never break unless you break it on purpose which i don't know why it would but the filter will because like it will run out of like you know you'll filter too much thing to get clogged up but yeah this mask will not break it'll last you five years but hey let's look at the fact that covid19 won't be around for another five more years you know five more years covid19 is long gone by then so yeah this thing, it's an investment, that's what I can say, it's an investment. You wear this every day, uh, then your money will be well spent, well invested on. Because like, you know, you wear, you wear it every day, uh, you, when you get back home, you just have to sanitize it, just have to wash it, you know? Not, not wash it like how I showed you just now, but sanitize it with wet tissue and all that. No big deal, again. 
and you can reuse it the next day. You don't have to throw it away. And it'll last you for a long, long time. So definitely get a gas mask. Don't get that surgical mask. That's just my opinion to protect yourself. The surgical mask, right, it's not very good to protect yourself with in the first place. And it doesn't provide you a good seal. Whenever I use the, the surgical mask, uh, my glasses fog up. Same with my friends, their glasses fog up. And it gets kind of annoying sometimes. And you just have to like pinch the iron to make sure that it doesn't fog up the glasses. And according to the news I saw, they said if your glasses fog up when you're wearing those masks, that means that you don't have a good seal. But that's not the most important thing when it comes to selecting a mask that's right for you. Fit is the first thing. If the, no matter how good the mask is, if it doesn't fit your face, then put it back. There's barely any leakage coming from this mask. Now check this out. Um, this is the unsealed mask. If the mask doesn't fit your face, then air will simply move around rather than through the mask. If your glasses fog up, your mask doesn't fit very well. See? And what happens if you don't have the good seal? That means that you won't have the provided protection of that mask. The face mask is supposed to protect you, the surgical mask. It's, it's supposed to protect you or protect another person. If you don't have the correct seal, it won't serve its function. It's basically useless. So yeah, this thing would definitely has a good seal. If you're saying that it doesn't have a good seal, that's because number one, it's either the wrong size for you, and number two, you either did the straps wrong. Because hey, look at this bro. One, two, three, four. Two, wait, four, five, six. Six straps. There is no way you can't get a good seal. Six straps, you know. Six straps on your head. And tell me that you don't get a good seal unless you have a beard or whatever. So yeah. So definitely get a gas mask. You want to get it, get it from the guy that I put in the link in the description. Selling it for the cheapest price. So get a gas mask. That's just my opinion at the end of the day. You don't have to listen to it, you don't have to agree. But maybe you can take it in mind, take it in consideration and yeah. Uh, if you want to filter out the virus, right, you need a P3 filter. This is a P2 filter. I'm not sure if it's going to be effective or not. I'm ordering the P3 filter and I'll inform you when it arrives if you join my Discord server. And not to mention, if you want to have a better view on the mask, you want to see the angles that you haven't saw, like here, here, whatever. You want to look at the inside, you know, if you like that detail and all that. You, you're thinking of ordering it, you, you want to ask me questions and all that. Join my Discord server, ping me anytime you want, just not at night when I'm sleeping. And we'll get into a video call together and I can show you the mask. I can personally show it to you. Uh, because, yeah, I can show the mask to you and all that. So yeah, you have any questions, you want to look at it from any angles or whatever, just join the Discord server, uh, my Discord server. But yeah. Uh, well, there's nothing much to talk about now, so that's about it for this video. This video has been extremely long and very uh, hard to edit. If you made it this far, you might as well consider giving it a thumbs up. Uh, I mean, you don't have to, but it'll be nice if you do. But yeah, they'll be nice. Just give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel.